Download this code and get free GPT-40 from CodeGive.com, link in the description below. When dealing with large files in Java, reading them entirely into memory can lead to out-of-memory error exceptions if the files are larger than the available heap space. To handle large files efficiently, you can read them in smaller chunks or use streaming methods. This tutorial will show you how to read a large file using buffered reader and file input stream, while processing it line by line without loading the entire file into memory. Hashtag 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 tutorial, reading large files in Java. Hashtag 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 1. Using buffered reader. Buffered reader is a convenient class for reading text from a character input stream. It uses a buffer to read data efficiently. Hashtag 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 example code. Hashtag 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 explanation of the code. One file path, set the file path variable to the location of your large file. Two buffered reader, we use buffered reader to read the file line by line. This is memory efficient as it reads only a portion of the file into memory at a time. 3 reading lines, the while loop continues until there are no more lines to read. Each line can be processed immediately, which avoids keeping all lines in memory. For exception handling, we wrap the file reading in a try with resources statement to ensure that the buffered reader is closed automatically. Hashtag 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 2. Using files.new buffered reader, Java NIO. Java NIO, new IO, provides a more modern way to handle file IO. You can use files.new buffered reader for a similar approach. Hashtag 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 example code. Hashtag 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 explanation of the code. Java NIO path, uses paths get, file path, to create a path object for the file. Read with NIO. Similar to the previous example but uses files.new buffered reader, for reading the file. Hashtag 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 conclusion. Using buffered reader either with traditional IO or Java NIO allows you to read large files efficiently without running into memory issues. By processing each line as it is read, you can handle files that are significantly larger than your available memory. When working with very large files, Consider also applying additional techniques, such as filtering or summarizing data, to further manage resource usage.